the European Union studies that you can have here uh, at the European Institute gives you a very good balance between the academic approach and between very friendly and cozy atmosphere within the group, because we work in a very small groups, with the professors that are very approachable, even though they're very good experts uh, in, their, in their issues. So I think that's a one very good advantage uh, of this program. I think that it takes into account all our different angles and needs, as students, I mean, coming from, from these different courses, and to a certain extent, they are flexible, they adapt, the discussions that we are having according to what we need and what are our backgrounds and expertises. I'm not sure if you would get that anywhere else. So this is what I really recommend. I had, I would say, a considerable amount of experience about the European Union before I came here. Of course, when I came here, the reality is different. <laughs> Dealing with the Commission is, is different. I have um, checked different uh, institutes and universities and, and uh, programs offering uh, studies about the European Union uh, over the past three years and uh, every now and then you know I check further and I want to to, to join one program but after thoroughly checking uh, the IEE and the MEOS program I have decided to opt for this program in specific. Of course it is all related to the substance, uh, to the program structure and to the uh, teaching staff and of course the administration and the management of IEE. I think it offers a very good balance between academic approach and everyday life approach. So I think when you want to deepen your knowledge but also make a next step in your career, you have various courses that you can choose that help you exactly with one or the other. Some courses really help you to understand the way of working or to understand the legislation behind it, while some are really more focused on yourself, how you as a professional make a next step in your career. And it's super beneficial one and the other at the same time. I'm so happy with um, the um, rich uh, substance of the teaching staff. Uh, this is very important uh, to me, for example. At this age, at, at my academic level and at my position, I don't expect, you know, I, I think I cannot tolerate just to come to be like a traditional classical student sitting and receiving info and knowledge. What makes this program distinct uh, by all, all means uh, is um, the methodology and the approach that is followed uh, to implement this program. It is a mature uh, approach. It depends to a great extent on uh, exchange of views, remarks, uh, academic uh, comments and interactions. Um, the academic staff, uh, the teachers, uh, have various uh, backgrounds, which I like so much. They don't come from one college or one university. They even don't come from one country, so they are diversified. And that really enriches our discussion and, and our uh, knowledge when it comes to this. The students themselves are diversified as well. So I had colleagues from uh, different EU countries, for example, but I had colleagues from Georgia, Serbia, Russia, and I come from Jordan. So whenever we had some certain point of discussion, we learned a lot from the experience and the knowledge and, and the academic background of, of each of us among, among ourselves.